Welcome back. As summer vacation comes to an end and kids head back to the classroom, parents may want to start asking their kids what they want to pursue as a potential career. Katie Smith is coordinator for the OSF Innovation Labs at OSF Healthcare, and she joins us to talk about a free website that can give kids from middle school on up and even some adults the idea about the types of jobs in healthcare and what they might want to consider. Good morning and welcome, Katie. Good morning. So there's going to be a website that can help people find a career in the medical field. Tell us about it. That's correct. So um, with University of Illinois Chicago, OSF uh, partnered up and received a grant called the CHA Grant, Community Health Advocacy, um, working together to try to figure out how to make healthcare career um, information more accessible to kids. So how does it work exactly? So the person who's interested, so that could be a child or an adult, goes on to our website and they can pick one of two routes. They can either explore careers on their own okay, or um, they could take a test, a kind of a personality test. Do you like uh, blood? Do you, are you introverted or extroverted? Those kind mm. of questions and based on those questions then the website kind of hones in on some careers that it thinks that you would be good at. Yeah, what are some potential careers? I know you named off a few earlier when we were talking. Yeah, so there are things like physician and nurse, which is what everybody kind of thinks about when they think about healthcare careers. Very true. But also things like laboratory medicine or physical therapy, uh, medical visualization, things like that. Yeah, and why do you think this is such a great resource for someone who may be undecided about the career they want to pursue? Yeah, so as a person that didn't really know what I wanted to do when I um, got out of high school, I kind of spent a lot of time uh, just trying to figure out what I wanted to do. And had I had a website or application like this that I could go on to that would have honed in on those careers, I probably wouldn't have spent as much time on careers that weren't necessarily going to be my um, end goal. Yeah. yeah, that can save you time and money, especially if you just go straight to college and you finish your prereqs and now you don't know what's next because you have to decide, right? Yeah. So where can our viewers find more information about the website? So healthcarecareers.guide, so that's a little bit different, okay. um, but if they go on that website, it, take, it goes directly to those questions. So what would you, what would be the recommendation for adults? So let's say they're matched with a career that they're interested in. They still have to pursue an education, right? Or do you guys offer resources to help with that track? Yeah, so the app or the um, website helps to give that information. It gives salary information. Mm. Um, it gives schooling information. So how long will it take you to get through uh, the schooling? It gives all kinds of information. And then it kind of guides into what careers or jobs are open right now in those careers. So say you got laboratory technician, there is a way on that website that you can click to see what jobs are open right now. So it's really great. It sounds really great. Hopefully yeah. this is something that spreads across other industries as well, because that can help, as I said, save time and money for a lot of people looking for potential careers. For sure. Katie, thank you so much for coming in and sharing this great website. Yeah, thank you. Of course. All right, guys, stick with us. We have more 25 News Good Morning coming up after the break.